Well, coming up, exercising memory and attention learning RX shows us how to train our brain while having a good time. Uh oh. <laughs> All right, today marks the start of Brain Awareness Week, and for more than 30 years, Learning RX has helped clients retrain their brain to enhance cognitive skills while having a little fun. And here to lead us in one of her favorite brain games is Executive Director Maureen Loftus. So, welcome, Maureen. Of course, you're coming in the Monday after daylight yeah. saving time. Seriously. Is there really something that, like, our, our brains, like, maybe aren't firing quite as quick? It may not be, but I think it's really more in our mind that that happens. Okay. And there are a lot of things that you can do to keep your brain really sharp okay so we think about that um, we focus so much on our body with the exercise going to the gym mm -hmm. getting a walk in etc we don't think about our brain mm -hmm. and you can do so much for your brain to keep it active it, you don't have to think that as you age you're gonna lose your memory that's not the case it's only because you don't use your brain that you lose your memory but if you use your brain every day in very fun ways you can keep that memory very strong and that's what we're gonna do today is a memory game which is a lot of fun okay right. so what is distraction okay so what you're gonna do is you guys are alternating going to pick up a number okay you have to remember the sequence of numbers okay oh, now if you get a card that says distraction pick up a distraction card read the question answer the question then repeat the sequence of numbers oh. So, okay. the first number we have directions. is eight. Okay. All right, so who's going to go first? I'll go first. All right, go ahead and pick up a number. Okay. Three. Okay, so now repeat the... Eight, three. Okay, put the three down. Okay. Next. Go ahead. Okay. One. Now repeat all three numbers. Eight, three, one. Very good. Okay. Uh, n nine? Yes, okay. but it's also a distraction. So before you oh. say the sequence of numbers, oh. answer the question on the card. Okay. Uh, close your eyes and try to touch your fingertips together. So do that now? Yeah. Okay. Okay, now what's the sequence of numbers? 8319. Very good. Oh gosh. <laughs> okay, 83198. 83198. Only once. Two. 831982. Okay. Eight. <laughs> 831982. Eight. Mm -mm, I don't like this. <laughs> A uh, four no. and a distraction. Yeah. Distraction. Okay. Before you can do the sequence of numbers. Okay. Would you rather vacation at the beach or in the mountains? The beach. beach. <laughs> <laughs> eight, three, one, nine, eight, two, eight, four. No. I missed uh, it. Oh, really? I thought that was It wasn't. Right. Oh, eight, two, eight, four. Yes, you're correct. You must. Okay. Did I? Uh, yeah, you're right. Go oh, whew. Go. Go ahead. Keep going. You're doing great. Three. And a distraction. And a distraction. Oh, and a distraction. Okay. distraction. Go ahead. Okay. If you had to change your name, what would you change it to? I could see it was like a Rachel. Oh, Rachel. <laughs> Call me Rachel, Rachel Green. Green. <laughs> A31983. <laughs> I cannot was, remember was, all of those yeah, numbers now. Was, I, I'm, I'm serious. Yeah. Okay. It, and that's a problem. So then what happens now that I, I mean, do you seriously keep going until yes. you go through all of these? You could, you could, you oh can gosh. actually get to the point where you could remember all of those cards. Oh. And what you want to do is keep trying. So now you have this many cards. Let's say we had 10. Okay. Now let's see if we can get to 11. Now mm. let's see if we can get to 12, 13. Mm. Keep at, at, increasing the level of difficulty. It gets to the point where you can remember 15 easy. It's tough when you get to 20. Mm. Wow. Um, do you recommend, you know, the crossword puzzles that we've heard of, the word uh, puzzles and games? The, the Sudoku, all of those kinds of things. What I tell people is do things you're not good at. Okay. We all tend to gravitate to the things we're good at. I'm really bad at crossword puzzles, so I do them all the time. Okay. But some people are really good at them, and they can just sit there and complete the entire puzzle. So not puzzle. challenging. Not challenging. You're not stretching your brain. You want to do something that makes your brain uncomfortable. Makes sense. And that you are not very good at. Like so, this game. <laughs> can, now, is this something that, like, anyone, I mean... Anybody can get this. It's, you can get it on Amazon, go to Target, whatever. Okay. And there's many games like this. This and the five-second rule. There's a number of different games oh, that yeah. are really fun yeah. and enjoyable. And, and exercise your brain at the same time. You can do it at home with your friends, family. You can do it at work. And the more you do it, the stronger your brain gets. All right. This All is right. really awesome. fun. Thank yes. you so much, Maureen. Appreciate Learning it. LearningRx.com. LearningRx.com. Right. Thank, Thank you so, so much. much.